Welcome to today's video. Today I drew a salamander that I found out in the backyard. Um, I believe it is a northern slimy salamander. And you will be able to find this illustration free for download as a coloring page on my Facebook page. Some fun facts about the northern salamander. Northern slimy salamander. Um, their main diet consists of ants and beetles, so bugs, and earthworms. Their skin secretes toxins, which can be poisonous when eaten because it goes straight to your blood. Juveniles are more toxic than adults, too. Their skin is very absorbent, so make sure not to touch them if you find them because the oils and the salt from humans can seriously hurt them. Some salamanders can live two to three decades. That is a long time for such a little creature. It's crazy. And some salamanders have four legs, some only have two, some have lungs, some have gills, and some of them just breathe through their skin. Now I'm just going off of what I just read off the internet. Um, from, and I got this information from multiple sources. Uh, so I don't know the exact like stipulations, but the salamander spirit can be lucky to some people, which I found very interesting. Because it's such a tiny little insignificantly, er, in, insignificant seeming animal, but it's actually really cool. The salamander spirit symbolizes transition and the ability to face challenges and flourish in adversity. The meaning of the salamander promises change and enlightenment. It's, a, it's symbolic in nature in regards to fire, flames, immortality, passion, and rebirth, just like the phoenix. Most species of salamanders actually have teeth, both in their upper and lower jaws. And unlike frogs, even the larvae of salamanders have teeth. The larvae teeth are shaped like pointed cones, though, and then the, the teeth of the adults are adapted to enable them to readily grasp prey. Some common predators that eat salamanders could be crayfish, giant water bugs, snakes, birds, shrews, frogs, fish, skunks, raccoons, and other small animals. We have a lot of those down here, so it makes sense why um, like all the creeks that I come across have like lots of salamanders and frogs and tiny fish and uh, crawdads. We see a lot of rabbits and possums around here as well, and, and raccoons, which was already listed. So I'm sure they also eat salamanders. Down here, people like to catch salamanders and crawdads to use as a uh, fishing bait. There are 500 species of amphibians that can be classified as salamanders. And the most common salamander is the spotted salamander. It can get up to seven inches, and the average lifespan in the wild is up to 20 years. All salamanders can swim through water, and they all do this by, like, wiggling their whole body. I've seen it, and they are really fast. It is crazy. You, you see them one second, and then, like, say you go to poke it, it is just gone. You see, like, water splashing, and then nothing. It just dips out so fast. You know how newts and axolotls are very popular pets? They are actually types of salamanders. Moving on to drawing, um, this I don't feel like this was my strongest drawing I've ever done, but it wasn't bad. It's still a fun little coloring page. It's got some wiggles and some little flowers and clovers and rocks. Uh, you know, it's something to color. Uh, I used a chisel tip uh, Prismacolor drawing pen marker thing to uh, ink this. I feel like I would have had a little bit more control if I had used a sharpie. Using this chisel tip was a little wonky. My camera died for the last couple minutes of recording this, so I apologize you don't get to see me ink the flowers and the clovers. It wasn't, you know, that exciting. It's just the same stuff over and over again. Let me know what you think about the new editing, like cutting, zooming in and out. Let me know how you feel about it, because it's not that hard for me to add into my videos, my drawing videos at least. I feel like it adds more visual interest, but I know when I zoom in it is a little bit more blurry, so let me know how you feel about it. Um, again, you can find this coloring page on my Facebook page. The link will be in the description. 
I hope you found this video entertaining and informative. I know I found out a lot of really cool facts about these little salamanders that I see on a daily basis and I didn't know how cool they were. I hope you have a wonderful day and happy crafting.